Greetings everyone, this is those. Uh, right now I'm actually going to show you how do I connect all of my cables together in one power grid. If you're new here, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and also turn on notifications for more videos. Yeah, I want to thank you if you are new on the channel, please subscribe and also give it a thumbs up and uh, give a comment below, don't forget about that. But anyhow, I'm not gonna talk more about my cables and my cable placements. As you can see here, all of this, it doesn't matter if it's on right now because I'm not gonna talk about that anyways. Uh, I like to keep my equipment free of dust. Anything goes like in the dust or whatever, you know, because I don't wanna, it's kinda hard, you know, right now I'm just holding it here. You know, because of the dust and everything, so I don't wanna, uh, nothing to break because a lot of stuff here is really expensive including that so as you can see i have uh, something right here to keep it out of the dust as most as possible i have a light right there so it's the only light source that i have right now and we're not actually going to show all my cables all right i'm going to show all my cables uh, everything that is connected to this device the foreman uh, m8xar um, everything, all my equipment, speakers, um, stuff, pedals, anything to do with um, electricity, they all connected to here because of the sound conditioner. And actually, I did a video of this, so if you want to check it out, somewhere over here or here, I don't know where, but uh, go check it out. And you're gonna see more information about it. Okay, right now, I'm actually gonna go from this device all for Mac Control. I have four of them. They're all down there, as you can see. They're all a mess right now. And they all go around all the way to here. There's four different ones for each individual of one. So that's mostly I start with that one. And after I will go to four speakers. We have four of them. One on each, each side right here. They're also connected down there. This little wiring right there. It's very hard to keep it all clean. And now I have uh, this interface also connected down there through the back of the foreman. The foreman has an extender too for more inputs of the electricity. Memory right here. That's, that also uses external power so it's going to go to the foreman and the computer itself now the keyboard it goes to um also a external towards the back of the rack <laughs> all the way in the back towards the foreman as well as this uh, preamp right here the gray design 101 the classic one this one also has a power source towards the foreman to and this one too so both of them are a different power source to the foreman to get a clean sound microphone doesn't really need any because you get it from the actual um actual power source from the computer or the preamp or the or the focus right okay so this actually is some of the back right there and even the the power of the lights the two light main, main source gets it from the uh, foreman so it's really important to have all those together as well let me show you it's a quite a mess if you guys listening around my wife is singing to the baby right now this is also the other side of the other cables they're all around the studio i mean you actually work with whatever you have and also this light Mostly I have a four to, I think so, no, 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 seven, 700 worth of uh, Mugabe cables gold. I only use those because I get a lot of warranty and also the sound quality, you're going to drop it all the way to negative zero. So um, paying the extra money for it is really worth it. This is a lot of the cables I put in and how you can see all the Mugabe cables in one of the software with the other type of uh, cables right here and they are all go towards the the back you see right 
este, hopefully I can show up. There we go. You see? They all go towards the foreman and the uh, foreman of the, the extender. Right now it's at a 125 volt. You want to mostly at 120 volt for to be able to work as a speak in dust. Okay, I'm not really showing too much, but I mean, what it matters is how you place your cables, where you put your power source from, where and from who. So, if you like this video, please subscribe to the channel and also give a thumbs up. And until the next one, bye. Oh, 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 oh,